Hello everybody, it's Mark Griffin here, uh, Prism Product Manager. Delighted to be here at the Cardano Summit 2021. In this presentation, I'm going to talk about Atala Prism and how it can power the trust economy. I'm also going to talk about Atala Prism at a glance, give you a quick overview of the Atala Prism platform and the applications. I'm going to talk about the Atala Prism Pioneer Program, which will start straight after the summit. Atala Prism and how it interacts with the Cardano ecosystem. And then lastly, we're going to announce a strategic partnership. So let's start off with Atala Prism at a glance. I'll give a brief overview of the platform and the applications. So what is Atala Prism? Atala Prism is IOHK's self-sovereign identity solution that's built on top of the Cardano blockchain. And it's going to enable a variety of use cases some of which I'll discuss today. The Atala Prism product suite consists of four different applications. First is a smart card, which is a low-cost smart card for receiving, storing, and sharing credentials for those that don't own a phone. A mobile application, an Android and iOS, that allow users to receive, store, and share their verifiable credentials. A management console, which is a web-based platform, that will allow organizations to easily create, issue, and verify digital identities and credentials. And along with the management console, a browser wallet, which is a, a browser-based extension, which will manage DIBs and authorize credential issuance. The platform itself consists of a number of layers. The SDKs, as functionality for three different use cases, decentralized identity, verifiable credentials, and cryptography. The platform itself contains the protocol. And then the, the DLT is the Cardano blockchain. And we use the metadata in the transaction. So what's the value of a Tala Prism for enterprises? First is to provide seamless access to digital services by simplifying the sign-up and sign-in processes. Built-in privacy will give users full control of how their identity is shared. Enhanced security based on rigorous peer-reviewed identity and zero-knowledge proof academic research. And it will allow new opportunities through new products and business models. Cost savings can also be achieved from customer onboarding, data management, security, and lifecycle management. There will be a reduced risk of fraud as, they're, as we're going to be using decentralized identities. There will be no login IDs and passwords to steal and reuse. So what's the value of a Tala Prism for governments? There's going to be a reduced cost to serve with minimum face-to-face -face phone and other verifications. A reduced cost of fraud against citizens, businesses, and governments, including police recorded fraud prevention and response. Improved customer experience which would also be an uplift for e-commerce and m-commerce, targeted selling and purchasing security. Citizen value generated with less spent time spent verifying and authenticating, managing documents and filling out forms manually. A Tala Prism will also power government's digital transformation. So based on industry reports, digital identity can offer 13% of a GDP uplift by 2030 and bring economic value of 11 billion dollars per annum. There have been existing government initiatives that have given benefits of 99% of digital government services, for example, e-Estonia. And Dubai also had an initiative and that resulted in 1 billion pieces of paper per year eliminated. So let's look at some of the enterprise and government deployments for Atala Prism. The first is just announced. We have a deal with telecom provider DISH to provide verified digital identity to the user base. In Tanzania, we're going to be working with World Mobile Chain to provide decentralized identities to mobile users, allowing them to access banking and other financial services, such as microloans. In the Republic of Georgia, we're working with the Ministry of Education to build a blockchain-based digital identity system for allowing university students to receive verifiable educational credentials when they graduate. And in Ethiopia, 
We're going to create the first government endorsed digital identity solution for 5 million students. So now let's talk about the Atala Prism Pioneer Program. So very excited to introduce this. This will allow developers and organizations to build identity solutions or integrate identity into your Cardano apps. It will allow access to a highly interactive training and a certification program. And there will be funding available to bring your life, your ideas to life via Project Catalyst. So you can now go to atalaprism.io slash pioneers and register your interest today. For the Prism Pioneer program, you'll be able to use the SDK Toolkit. Now, the SDK Toolkit, as I said, contains, consists of modules that provide all the necessary functionality to deal with cryptographic primitives, identities, and credentials. The crypto module provides those primitives for cryptography. The identity module includes information to work with DIDs, and the credential module allows you to create verifiable credentials. The SDK Toolkit will su support the following platforms, JVM, Android, iOS, and web. The SDK will also support interaction with the Cardano blockchain. There's going to be a detailed tutorial and extensive walkthrough of how to integrate the SDK into your application and the supported platforms. So now we're going to have Lars, our Director of Education. He's going to give a brief overview of the program and the key course takeaways. Hello, everyone. My name is Lars Brunjes. I am the Director of Education at Input Output, and I will be teaching the PRISM Pioneer program. And in that program, you will learn all the important concepts and techniques to interact with PRISM. So to create and handle digital identities, create certificates and share them and check them. And I just ran two iterations of the Plutus Pioneer program, where I taught Plutus to thousands of pioneers. And that was highly successful. And therefore, I intend to run the PRISM Pioneer program in a similar format. So there will be weekly lectures that are pre-recorded. There will be a Discord channel for discussions and questions and support. And there will be weekly Q&A sessions where you can ask me live questions and I'll do my best to answer them. And as with the Plutus Pioneer program, I hope that you will also support each other so I was very pleased to see that a lot of the questions that came up in Discord didn't even have to be answered by myself or my team because pioneers were very friendly and very helpful to each other and often supported each other and spent a lot of time getting other people set up right and helping them with questions and so on. So yeah, that's the idea for the program. Weekly lectures, weekly Q and H sessions, Discord channel, and then together we'll explore the possibilities of Prism and try all the important workflows with digital identity and certificates. So I hope a lot of you will join and I'm very much looking forward to the program. See you then. Thank you. So what's the value of a Tala Prism for developers and partners? It's going to give a reduced cost to serve with lower transaction fees on the Cardano blockchain, flexible and extensive SDKs with Atala Prism feature rich and multiple languages, and easy to use documentation that's essential for developers. Training and certification is going to be available by the Prism Pioneer program, and there's going to be a very variety of funding mechanisms through Catalyst. B fund and an Africa fund with details to follow on that. Let's just talk about the funding opportunities that are available in Project Catalyst. So in Catalyst, the Cardano community sources brilliant ideas, decides via a vote, and the Treasury finances the best ideas for building a global blockchain. In the next funding round, there's going to be a specific standing challenge called the Itala Prism Did Mass Adoption Challenge. And the next round will offer $500,000 
and Ada. So in summary, you can visit atalaprism.io slash pioneers and register your interest today. Let's now talk about Atala Prism and how it can interact within the wider Cardano ecosystem. Again, Prism is a layer two solution that's built on top of Cardano. And it provides additional functionality, namely identity. And it can also integrate with Cardano products and protocols like Daedalus, Marlow, Plutus, and the Dop Store. As an example, of enhancing the Cardano ecosystem, let's just take the DAP store. So the biggest problem that DAP developers have is providing their legitimacy. So a Tala Prism will allow these DAP de developers to verify their identity. It will allow multiple levels of verification. It will provide automatic, manual and formal certification. It will allow verified DAP reviews, ratings and comments, and eventually we could even add credit scores. Let's then talk about another instance of RealFi. Uh, in this instance, I'm going to talk about a smallholder farmer use case. In this use case, the Ethiopia's Agricultural Transformation Agency, the ATA, could implement an e-voucher solution for small farmers. Farmers could be onboarded via a secure privacy-preserving process that records their biometrics. A smart card can then be provisioned to farmers that don't have a mobile app. The smart card can then be loaded with a spendable e-voucher that contains their allowed limit for their supplies, whether it's fertilizers, equipment, or seed. And the cooperatives can easily verify the farmer's identity, ensuring that their requests are legitimate before allowing farmers to redeem those vouchers. So in summary, how can PRISM increase Cardano's ecosystem? First, by enablement, offering participants an end-to-end -end experience including training and certification, and a go-to-market support via a marketplace. Growing, leveraging the funding via Catalyst, the C Fund, and an upcoming Africa Fund, it allows to grow the ecosystem. Differentiating, we're going to enable payments and governance to enable those real five use cases. Standardization democratizing our technology so everyone can use it as a service. And adoption, providing access through different channels, such as an upcoming credential alliance for bespoke solutions. So next, I'm delighted to announce a strategic partnership. So we're gonna partnership with Accuant, which is the leading global trusted identity platform for fraud prevention and AML compliance. So global financial authorities are extending regulations to include DeFi platforms and services. So Accent will enable trust in a Cardano ecosystem by enabling the verification of users and organizations. Incorporating KYC will ensure actors in the DeFi space remain compliant with a rapidly evolving regulatory environment. So Atala Prism is going to integrate with two of Accent's products, Accent Assure ID and Accent Compliance. So I'm now going to hand over to Accuant, who's going to give a quick overview of Accuant and this exciting partnership. Hello all, Jose Caldera here from Accuant in our Palo Alto office. I'm very excited to tell you about Accuant and our partnership with Input, Output and Atala Prism. Accuant has a rich history in working with hundreds of global partners in every major industry and almost every country and territory in the world. We provide identity proofing technologies and solutions that enable our clients and partners to evaluate individuals and businesses and assess whether they can be trusted or not. We have verified billions of identities worldwide for transactions that range from opening a bank account to crossing a border or simply checking for age verification. Our trusted identity platform has been built with purpose and serves our mission to power trust for all. We aim to empower our clients with inclusive technology that allows them to execute on their vision of providing services to all demographics, even those that may be otherwise financially underserved. We truly believe that understanding identities and whether they can be trusted or not is fundamental for fairness in how individuals and businesses access to all kinds of services. 
This is one of the many reasons, but perhaps the most important, on why this partnership with Input Output is so exciting to us. We share the belief in creating technologies that have a positive social impact. The fundamental concepts that are built within the Cardano blockchain align very well with our principles of democratization of trust. Blockchain is not new to us. We started supporting the cryptocurrency industry back in 2013. Today, Accuant Technology partners with over 40% of the banks in the United States that support crypto businesses. And our KYC and anti-money laundering technology support close to 100 blockchain-based businesses, including more than 50 digital currency exchanges worldwide. We're thrilled to be powering a part of a Prism. We firmly believe that the individuals should hold the keys to their identity, controlling the what, how, and where their data is shared, and having the assurance that it is secure. Initially, we'll be providing our world-class KYC, include our patented electronic DNA, document verification, biometrics, and social network analysis technologies. And in the near future, we'll provide seamless access to our entire portfolio of anti-money laundering and fraud prevention solutions. At Acumen, we understand that technology will not stand still. We have built a platform because we know that a point solution can effectively address the many use cases that are required to assess trust and evaluate identities. Furthermore, the technologies of today will not be sufficient for tomorrow. We want our partners to be confident that we will solve those needs. We're looking forward to building this relationship and see vast opportunities as many governments as well enterprises, small and large, are moving towards using blockchain in areas such as finance, supply chain, digital identity, education, energy, intellectual property, and so much more. Thanks so much for your time and looking forward to working together. So here we can see a KYC verified identity in a Tata Prism. And this verified identity credentials will enable access to third party services. For example, in financial services, such as opening a bank account or applying for a loan, and regulated services, such as registering for a crypto exchange within an allowable jurisdiction. Users can easily share their verifiable identity credential, and they have full control of these credentials under the SSAA framework. So now I'm just going to show a quick walkthrough of Atala Prism, using integrating with Acuant and receiving a verified identity credential in Atala Prism. Our driver's license. They will first be asked to scan the front of the document. And once that's processed, the user will then be asked to scan the back of the document. Next, they'll be asked to take a selfie. Calls to the Accurate SDK are initiated and the identity document is checked. The selfie will have a library is checked done and will be matched with the photo in the document. Once this is processed, the user then will be asked to confirm the attributes are correct. If so, a verified identity credential is created, it's signed on the Cardano blockchain and then issued to the user. Profile attributes such as the name and date of birth are also updated based on the document. The user will then receive a notification when the credential is received in the app. The user can view the credential in the credential listing. They can also view the blockchain transaction that was created on signing as displayed, as well as the JSON format of the credential. And that's the end of the presentation. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you.